Hello there guys, and welcome back to Universe Sandbox Square 2. Today we're going to be adding stars to the solar system. And now we watch the chaos unfold. And we're going to turn on orbits. Okay, so Jupiter got captured, sort of, in the orbit of this other star. Mercury is but the only planet that's still in orbit of the original sun. The Earth is now orbiting this star, looks like. It's still going pretty fine. Considering the fact that it got completely knocked out of the orbit of the sun. You get me running into a problem very quickly. Okay, so... Where did Earth go? I think we may have a problem soon. I think those two stars are going to... Maybe not, they might just miss each other. <laughs> Pretty much all of the smaller outer bodies have completely vacated the system. Oh, okay.
Okay. I think as one final... Hmm. Let me just sort of get something. But it's more very slow, gradual chaos into setting everything that went wrong. There was no. Hmm. I'm not sure how to say it. Most feels like things went initially wrong, and then everything just kind of settled into a new orbit. I mean, the orbits are kind of changing, but not really that much. I'm going to open the solar system again, but this time I'm going to add the sun itself. Hmm. Proxima Centauri then? Okay, I'm going to use Proxima Centauri. Proximus star. Let me get the mass of the sun, or at least like close to the mass of the sun. So, 0.99 sun. Now let's look at the orbits. Okay, now we go to So the apocenter. So the very center changes. And let's electricity to point nine. Point nine nine. There we go. So it's not gonna do much when it's all the way out here. But we speed things up. Yeah, I know it will move at some point eventually.
motion. Okay, so the speed is starting to increase now. I'm gonna follow it. Okay, now we're going along at a decent pace. Okay, the orb is starting to get a little bit wobbly. What I'm most concerned about is how this affects the inner solar system. Because I think that's where the real excitement is going to happen. Of course, Neptune's orbit just gets completely screwed over so we're not slowing it down all the orbits are just getting completely slingshotted outward. Okay, I'm gonna slow things way down. It's way down. None of the plants are liking this a lot. As long as this star and this star don't meet, we're fine. Proximus Centauri stole Mercury, and it stole Earth. Question is, will it keep them? Looks like it will. That's more desired effects. <laughs> effect I was going for. So, anyways guys, that's it for this video. Like and subscribe for more great content. And goodbye.